Dodeca. When your dad and I were in high school, one summer we came up with this competition called the Dodeca Pentathlon, which is basically 25 events. And who won? You lost. <laughs> How's life, bro? You happy? Absolutely. Look in my eyes and answer that. I'm happy. So what about you? Are you happy? Then shut up about it. About myself, and uh, I live in Los Angeles, and um, like I said, I'm, I'm in the Dodeca Pentathlon, which is the latest movie from the Duplass brothers, and uh, I've worked with those guys quite a lot. Um, I was in a short film called The Intervention that they made, and I was in a movie called Baghead that they made, as well as uh, Cyrus and Jeff Lewis at Home. There are two recent studio features. Mm -hmm. And um, how did, uh, did you have to audition for this part or did they already have you in mind? I auditioned for the Duplass Brothers many moons ago for one of the films they were making in New Orleans. Uh, and since then we just developed a relationship and I've never had to audition <laughs> after that, thankfully. <laughs> so they, just, they just put me in their movies, which, yeah. which is a good thing, I like that. <laughs> So you guys, um, you guys are all from Louisiana. Yes, we Did actually all went to the same high school. We went to Jesuit High School in New Orleans, Louisiana, and uh, Mark Duplass is a year younger than me, and uh, Jay's about three years older. And uh, we all knew of each other in high school, but we really became friends after high school. When we started working. like Louisiana is such a hotbed for, for talent right now. I mean, a lot of movies are being made. There's a lot of talent there. Yeah. How did you get so lucky? I mean, because I know the film industry is very competitive. Um, I... Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it is luck, I, and I don't know, I don't know why. Um, I mean, I'm still, you know, you know, I'm still, you know, there's still things I need to achieve in terms of my career. Uh, uh, there's still places I haven't gotten to yet, but, um, you know, Mark, Jay, and I all kind of went to the same high school, so they they knew me, and um, Mark had seen me act and play as a Jesuit, and uh, we were kind of just, I was on their radar. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know how to answer that. <laughs> I guess I just it's lucked luck. out. Yeah. Luck and talent. Yeah. So tell me a little bit about your role in this film. It, I mean, you're hilarious. You do a lot of physical comedy. Yes. I mean, which is really hard to be funny and to do that type of physical comedy. How did you prepare for that? Um, physical comedy is something I've kind of just always had in my back pocket. Um, ever since I was like in third grade, I was trying to make girls laugh to get their attention. <laughs> and, um, you know, uh, just being a class clown and being an actor and. Uh, that's one of the things I really love about the film is I do get a chance to do physical comedy. Uh, there's nothing better to me than sitting in a screening and hearing people laugh at me <laughs> making a fool of myself. <laughs> Relationship, basically, it's a story about two brothers that are rivals. Um, do you have any siblings? How did you mentally prepare for that? For that, I do. I have an older brother and a younger sister. And, and actually, at the beginning of the movie, I'm talking about my fictional brother uh, defecating in the bathtub. That I'm in. <laughs> but that actually really happened to me. My older brother oh Tim. My God did that to me when we were kids. <laughs> He's gonna love this then. <laughs> yeah, and uh, it scarred me. <laughs> oh my god. It didn't scarred me that bad, it, was, it made a great story. So I, I was able to draw upon that, and um, I was able to draw upon that for the movie. But it could, this could have never worked if it was like sisters or brother, sister relationship. It seems like the brother, brother relationship, like since Cain and Abel, you know, it's like very intense. And definitely, definitely. <laughs> and I should mention that this story is based on two real brothers that Jay and Mark grew up uh, living near. Uh, and they 
also with Darcy, high school that we went to. And these brothers did this. They competed against each other <laughs> in a multi-event personal Olympics <laughs> to see who the better brother was. Oh and they try to kick the crap out of each other. Mark and Jay, what is their directing style? I mean, since you're their friend, mm -hmm. how is that dynamic? Like, they have to be your boss. You know, yeah. how, do, how does that work out for you? Uh, it's fantastic. We have a shorthand and we have a trust with each other. And, you know, we always start with a script, but they give me a lot of freedom and scenes to improvise. And I love that as an actor. And I should say not every actor likes that, but I like that. Mm -hmm. um, there's something electric and scary and fun and interesting about improvising with, in the context of a dramatic scene or even a comedic scene. Mm -hmm. And uh, we just have a great trust relationship. Uh, do you guys do that in Cyrus as well? Like all the films, they do a little improv? Well, I think with their, I think with their studio movies, uh, they definitely encourage their actors to improvise as well. Um, but maybe not to the extent that yeah. they do when they make their micro-budget indie films, you know, uh, because when they, their studio movies, you know, there's a lot more money at stake and there's stars and things are a little more tense, yeah. probably, <laughs> you know, there's a little pressure. Um, so what's next for you? Um, I have something I'm cooking up right now. Mm -hmm. uh, that I can't really talk about. <laughs> uh, I've been instructed not to talk about Oh, no. Uh, but yes, uh, I'm just continuing to be an auditioning actor in Los Angeles and also working on my own projects with, with friends. <laughs> so what do you think of Dallas? I mean, when you got the call that you were going to come down here to, to screen this movie, I mean, how did you feel? Because this is... You know, the 42nd year for the USA Film Festival is a pretty prestigious, kind yeah. of, not many people really talk about it, but it's really like a prestigious film festival. So how did you feel when you when you knew this film was going to be shown here? Uh, I was excited, and I'm, I'm thrilled to see uh, all of Dallas that I've seen so far, and I really like what I've seen, and uh, the energy here seems good, and really seems like they're trying to cultivate independent film and uh, so far I have a really great feeling about Dallas. I've only been here for a day though. <laughs> so. Alright, well thank you so much. Thank you so much. I like the camera. Thank you.